how do we get people uh, in the Muslim community excited about their heritage, learning about their history, and seeing the Met as a resource that belongs to them just as much as it belongs to anyone else. People will assume that a museum is for certain types of people, certain audiences, certain income brackets. So these are populations that may not be comfortable coming to a museum or may not even know that this exists. We really made a great effort to bring in these people and for them to be aware of our galleries so that when they open, their communities can come and enjoy and learn in these galleries. They've done amazing outreach to the local New York Muslim community. They've done amazing outreach to non-Muslim communities and making sure that this isn't just a gallery by Muslims for Muslims, but that this is really about art and the values that art speak to. History and art have a way of giving people a sense of grounding, uh, a sense of pride in their origins, in their background, in their cultural achievements. When people see this stuff and they look around, they say, wow, this is something that people from my cultural universe did and contributed and made. And all these people are here putting money into it, coming to see it, really says to people that you have a place here, you have something to be proud of. That Islamic history is part of global history and therefore part of American history. Getting people to understand that, I think, would give them a very different perspective on being Muslim in the United States.